I want to pursue a female animal, I'll just say, they weigh an amount. <laughs> this is the largest of the... Thank you. Hello. Oh, wow. 800 pounds. And that trumpeting sound you're hearing is we just flew over us with a trumpeter swan. And it's, oh, the swan? Mm-hmm. Brush, even though they're amongst the sage, they're probably eating bitter brush. Sagebrush isn't too, help, too great for, uh, they don't gain much nutritional value from eating sagebrush. Fine. I was going to it's kind of hairless door, near its neck and uh -huh. top of its body. There's a disease going around. Well, there's a couple diseases going around. Um, I'm going to take a picture of it just because we have a lot of um, guides that uh, know elk disease much better than I do. So I want to see if someone can help me with that. Come on, look at that. Sick elk. <laughs> I wonder if the one on the far right has a cap that's the nickname for bison caps. They're called red dogs. Red dogs? Yeah. Because they're about the size of a dog and they're orangish red. So here's we'd like to take a look through the spotting scope. I put the elk, uh, sorry, bison cap in there. Okay. Well, that's this cool. is a you young one. Yeah, 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 yeah. It looks like we got a one baby going to the bathroom. There's some this crap coming out. Oh, look at the baby over there running. Oh, I'll get close that one. Oh, it's another one. So this is the Yellowstone Lake, which as you notice back there is this is the largest lake above 7,000 feet anywhere in the world, and it's very big. Yeah. Bison. So these are those. This is that bison that's gonna weigh two thousand pounds. He's yeah. like, really? I'm yeah. just here eating. What do y'all want? Really I wouldn't get out. Yeah, we won't open the door. No. This yeah. time. <laughs> wow. Will you take a picture for me, huh? Yeah, I will. So you can see he's an older fellow because he's got really dull horns. He's used them. He's older, and oftentimes, if they're gonna be by themselves, uh, they're often gonna be a bull, and then often too gonna be older. Just so chewing his cut. If it starts to move, I will, I will jet forward. <laughs> <laughs> that is pretty sick right there. Largest <laughs> land mammal on the continent right there. Ooh, and how big do you think this one is? He, he's probably 1,800 pounds, oh if I had to guess. Looks Those are cowbirds. And what they're doing is as the bison moves, it'll, the insects will be flushed away yeah. from the, the bison's hooves. Or yeah, look windows. out your window totally. and go, wow, look what yeah, I woke up to. And what's, <laughs> what's great is that they also have a clinic in uh, the lake area. So you can wake up, go get, you know, tossed by a bison and go right to the clinic. <laughs> so you don't have to go too far. That's awesome. The way that somebody was really using their noggin. That's right. <laughs> Kill. Yeah, the horns are more sharp. Yeah. I want to His head's profile. not near as big as the other one. <laughs> when we get to, we'll, we'll probably keep going. At Hayden yeah. Valley, we'll have more shot at bison, and actually those geyser basins too. We'll have more more shots at bison. Able to stop. Oh my goodness! Look Slow at roll. Just... All good. Huh? You get what you get, and you don't throw fit. <laughs> hey, dude. So, <laughs> just... Mudpot says very acidic uh, features in the park. Is that the sinky stuff? Or yeah, they're the most smelly features. So this is the smelliest part of our drive, God. also because okay. of the weather. Uh, but uh, yeah, Yellowstone River's on our right, mud pots on our left. Here's some pretty close. You can see the steam oh, mainly. Boy. Yeah, look at that. Classic Yellowstone smell. So what did the first explorers think? Uh, so when they, they, they were really amazed, the first would be John Coulter.
river heading on a downstream from the waterfalls, which we're going to move in that direction in a moment. There's four. Yeah, it looks like some more bulls. Man, they're so massive. Yeah, they are. You huge. see that tail uh, that's raised? Yeah. The, that's a sign of aggression. Oh, really? So they're getting kind of frustrated with us. Yeah, it's agitated at something. Looks like a chemical plant. Hello. Oh, that's close. This is massive. <laughs> like on the right, those are hot springs, and I see one, or I see two geysers going off. The two main ones, those are both different geysers. That's found paint pots. That's the geyser basin there. We're going to head over to Midway Geyser Basin. We'll see very similar, actually, where we're going to see there will be actually even more steam. Uh, so look at this one here. It's 150. It's kind of, you know, it's it's about dark green or dark blue. And then look at the next one on the right. It'll be turquoise. It's much hotter. Whoa. Oh. So the hotter it is, the more light blue. Yeah, this is big. This, this is all this hot water to the ground, and the outside is hot enough that if you stepped on it, it will burn, it will hurt your feet or burn your shoes at the least. He says, don't drop your hat because you don't get to go get it. This is a big one that's called the Excelsior Pleasure. Yeah, so like you can see it blowing out. And they said that this was at one time bigger than Old Faithful, but then its cap got loose. And when it did that, it allowed it all to just have the steam and water and hot water come up in a lot of areas instead, so it doesn't spray way out as much. But I'll bet these things are up four or five stories in terms of how high these clouds are going. It seems amazing that they don't have guardrails on this thing with all the other guardrails that are in the car. It's okay, you can step through. I just look back. Some of this mineral, he says, some of it is swarms of bacteria. I like seeing the bacteria. Yeah, he said, when you get down to the end, it turns real just because it's all got so hot that the material is all dry. And as we do, it goes off of the Excelsior Glacier into the river. Had, uh, mm -hmm. So it was $30, I think now it's like 15 uh -huh. but it's one time payment and so I've had it since, I've had this since. For Camper. Okay, I'll be cute. Oh, wait, like, where do we go? Uh, it's uh, right here, steaming. This one's right here? Uh, on the side of the river here. Oh, <laughs> a little bit higher. <laughs> it's kind of like our water Will feature. Will keep doing that, just keep getting a little bit higher? It looks like, okay. 
Well, if that's, if that, if that's Old Faithful, I'm really disappointed. Yeah, Bill. <laughs> yeah, we're going to turn around now, guys. We're going to head out to... Here, oh, we're good. Are we in Buddy's way? No. Then let's just stay here. I'll just see what this, this ranger that's leaving, they're maintenance, but they still may tell me to leave. Okay, well, if they uh, do, then we'll leave. It's up about oh, 12 it. foot now. Yep. It's kind of like a hot tub. Laid outside. It's kind of like come up a little bit. I like the little one, little actually. I think it's a little one. The little one way back there? Yeah, the Sweet back, now. yes. Imagine being on a horse 150 years ago. Oh, yeah. And you're, you're in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Come across this. That's the highest. Yeah, golly. Wouldn't that just blow your mind? Yeah, all right. So at the top. And then that's the Old Faithful Inn, second oldest inn in the park, made mostly of lodgepole pine. And because it says Old Faithful Inn parking, people don't really realize this also happens to be the closest parking lot to. I'm not getting it. 47F. Big O head. Eyes closed. Is it? Just Hold that side. Right? <laughs> Not a care in the world. Yeah. I go and there's a sign right there. Danger! Do not approach wildlife. <laughs> That's why it's sitting there. So it, it, want, it wants people to know not to approach me. I'm trying yeah. to. Say. Do not mess with me. It's funny. I love what you said. He's waiting on Taco Tuesday. <laughs> this is near, but not the actual. Old faithful. We'll get that in there. Yeah, the little mini ones. This is all paid for. No. So this is this is the uh, old paid for before it gets gone. It's good. You know, if you've ever stayed at home, it's, it's a little bit smaller than some of them. It's nice to have somebody who knows. You have to be so careful because it's always these little toys. Oh, I know. So, it's a little squirty thing. Yeah. Oh, why are we out here? It's here. It's cool. Over here is a little bitty one up here. Sit up here. Mom and Emma, Dad can sit in his car. What time is it? Seems like it's getting closer. There's more of these. Bigger puffs. <laughs> you can think of me when you see it. Oh, <laughs> somebody else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 somebody. Did we do? We went to uh, um, North Platte. North Platte, which has this the largest, the largest switchy, <laughs> train switchy. Oh, really? Change tracks. Yeah. Oh, that was cool. Something's coming. Oh. Is it a teaser again? Maybe. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Definitely be different than before. It's going more straight up. You think? I think it's more than that. Here it goes. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Seems to be dying down. 
ladies. Evet, evet. Evet, evet. So you should hear when it's a lot warmer. You can see the water. It's a lot of water. It's a lot of water. thousands of gallons going So if you guys would like, we can. He wants us the sooner we get out there, the better. Because if we're going to end, then you'll have to We don't want to miss all things again. Then we're in trouble. So it's just supposed to be a bathroom right now. Bathroom bridge. Come on, let's go back down. You can say it. Come here, come here. So this is a mud pot, I think it's a, or something, mud something. Anyway, it's where the water from the local area here and the parking lot and the snow and all that kind of stuff would flow into this with the groundwater and then the gases are coming below. They don't have underwater water, so this is what they call a mud something. I'll get it in a moment. So this is Lewis Falls. Okay, so we're looking out from way, way out there are the Grand Tetons. Sand hill. I'm seeing two geese and to the right of it. No way, it's, it's in. One. We're looking higher a little bit. It's to the, it might be just in that pine tree on the left, right behind it. It's horrible. Is there a bear chasing them? <laughs> oh, they're falling down now. Oh. They're starting to eat again. <coughs> Sometimes when an animal is exposed and don't want it, doesn't want to be, they'll move at a back. Oh. Because if you don't, the front of it will go down. Like you'll just tip over. So cool. And I didn't have to land. So luckily I you know, had told me. Oh, no worries. Sand Hill. Okay. Oh good, fly. I got his head up. They do fly. fly. Sand Hill cranes. Cheers. Look at her. Is that the cub? No, that's the mama. Yeah. Turn him back. Here's the cubs. Cub in front. There's the other one. All three together. Oh my goodness, he's so cute. <coughs> oh, 
I have one. Anybody have the other? And there's two cubs back there. There's some back to the right. I see. Yeah, that's maybe. Okay. The yeah. Uh, so is this the mama right here? Uh, or is that a cub? I think the two in view are both cubs. Okay. And then where's the other one? There's one right here. And there's one right is there. Is it the one that's blacker is over this one? See these two darker. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of a blob in the, yeah. in the shadows of the forest. Did yeah. you try to get a picture, Bill? Yeah, I'm trying. Wait a minute, I got three in. Oh, she comes out a little bit. I think. So I'm going to take this home and go, okay, find the bear. Come on, baby. Oh, is it going to come out a little bit? They're going to... They, they could potentially continue moving this way, especially with the road being there. So I think we may just want to wait it out, see if they decide to keep moving. Oh, there's one coming. Yeah, it's going to Oh, there's the other one. Yeah, I hate those. Turn out to be kind of hard because they both... Oh, that's cute. Oh, there's Aww. a good, there's oh, a good picture. Mom. Here's mom. Or people. I don't know if that third thing is people, is it? No, there she is, wide open. Let's bring it all three together. There we are. All three. She's moving to our way. <laughs> no, now she turned. See, bears be bears. Very cool. I know, right? You guys are wondering, do you get to see the grizzly now? 49 years, I Make know. Make sure and tell whoever's going to do it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's greatness. Yeah. Oh, this is the kind of video you need to have. Big bear pooping. <laughs> I believe, maybe. There's birds around the bottom, too. Yeah. Okay, you got to have our six there, Bill. Oh, wildlife man. You can just send me yours. Oh, that's... They're not well lit, but there's at least two down in there. Yeah, they're kind of hunkered down. Digging. Or eating. Oh, he's pointing and nodding. He's getting kind of a... Oh, there's people over there. It's not action in the right, but it's just... I know, don't you know it's just a pain in the rear to manage people? Hey. Oh, good. And in front of the tree. I get, yeah, right, right exactly. There no, we go. We got a good one here. Yeah, these are probably yearlings. <laughs> Any others moving? Not yet. Yeah, where's your... Gosh, look at him move the log. Well, that's where all the food is. <laughs> oh, guess. my goodness. The two of them work together and shoved a pretty she darn good sized log it's up. It's mom there. and baby working together. Yeah. You're right, though. They're just having a good time eating ants and stuff. Look at his big old camera. Yeah, yeah. that ranger would He's be like, quite uh, upset national... if you saw what they're doing. But See, that's... Really cool.